Hello everyone. Welcome to this series on the history of English literature. And in this video, we are going to discuss the historical background of the age of Milton. Introduction. The age of Milton spanning the mid 17th century is one of the most significant periods in English literature marked by profound political upheaval and literary innovation. Central to this era is John Milton 1608 to 1674 whose works embody the tensions and transformations of the time. The period saw the rise and new forms of literature including metaphysical poetry and political prose as well as the continuation of earlier traditions. The historical backdrop of the English Civil War, the Commonwealth and the Restoration deeply influence the principal authors of this time shaping their themes and styles the historical background 1630 to 1660 the years between 1630 and 1660 were dominated by the english civil war and the subsequent political turmoil the decade preceding the war was marked by increasing conflict between king charles i and parliament primarily over issues of taxation religious reforms and the extent of royal authority these tensions eventually led to the outbreak of civil war in 1642 the lead up to war 1630 to 1642 during this period monarchy's attempts to centralize power and enforce religious conformity caused widespread discontent Charles I's imposition of unpopular taxes such as ship money without parliamentary consent and his attempts to impose Anglican religious practices in Scotland sparked resistance that eventually contributed to the outbreak of war the civil war and the execution of Charles I 1642 to 1649 The civil war was a complex and multifaceted conflict involving not just the royalists and parliamentarians but also various religious and regional factions. The war resulted in significant social and political upheaval ultimately leading to the trial and execution of Charles I in 1649. This period also saw the emergence of radical political and religious ideas as people grappled with the profound changes taking place the commonwealth and commonwealth rule 1649 to 1660 the execution of charles i led to the establishment of the commonwealth a republican form of government that lasted until 1660 Under the leadership of Oliver Cromwell, England experienced a period of military rule and puritanical reform. However, the Commonwealth struggled with internal divisions and widespread dissatisfaction, leading to its eventual collapse and the restoration of monarchy in 1660. Principal authors of the age of Milton. Several key authors defined the literary landscape of the age of milton each contributing to the rich tapestry of english literature during this tumultuous time john milton 1608 to 1674 john milton is the most prominent figure of this period a poet polemicist and intellectual milton's works reflect the religious and political conflicts of his time His early works such as Lycidas and Comus are notable for their classical influences and complex symbolism. However, it is his later works, particularly Paradise Lost, that cemented his legacy. Written after the Restoration, Paradise Lost is an epic poem that explores themes of free will, divine justice, and the nature of authority. drawing upon Milton's deep engagement with the political and religious debates of his day Andrew Marvell 1621 to 1678 Andrew Marvell 
a contemporary of Milton, was both a poet and a politician. His work is characterized by his wit, metaphysical conceits, and political engagement. Marvel's poetry often reflects the complexities of the Civil War period, blending classical references with contemporary political concerns. His most famous poems, such as To His Coy Mistress and The Garden, exhibit a blend of sensuality and intellectual rigor. Robert Herrick, 1591-1674 Robert Herrick, though often characterized as a cavalier poet, also wrote during the age of Milton. His poetry is notable for its celebration of rural life, love, and the pleasures of the senses. Herrick's Hesperides is a collection of lyrical poems that reflect the poet's deep connection to the English countryside and his loyalty to the monarchy, even as the country was engulfed in civil strife. Sir Thomas Brown Sir Thomas Brown was a prose writer whose works are characterized by their meditative style and exploration of scientific, religious, and philosophical themes. His Religio Medici, 1643, is a personal reflection on faith and science, while Hydrotaphia, Urn Burial, 1658, is an essay on the nature of death and human morality. Brown's works reflect the intellectual curiosity and religious questioning that were hallmarks of the period. Richard Lovelace, 1618-1657 Richard Lovelace is another important poet of the period, known for his elegant lyrics and support of the royalist cause. His poems such as To Althea from Prison express a deep loyalty to the king and a romantic idealism that contrasts with the harsh realities of the civil war. Conclusion The age of Milton was a period of profound change both politically and culturally. The principal authors of this period, including Milton, Marvel, Herrick, Brown, and Lovelace, each responded to the challenges of their time in unique and enduring ways. Their works continue to be studied for their artistic merit and for the insights they provide into one of the most turbulent periods in English history. These authors not only reflected the complexities of their age, but also shaped the future of English literature, leaving a legacy that resonates to this day. So this was the discussion on the historical background of the age of Milton. We will meet in the next video and discuss some other topic. Until then, goodbye and thank you.